how to start modding Fallout 4. First of all, you want to go over to the Nexus Mod Manager to the Vortex page. You first need to create an account in this window here. And then you need to press the download the latest version now for the Vortex launch. The link to this will be in the description. Once you've downloaded and opened the Vortex launcher, you'll now need to find the location of Fallout 4. It may already appear right here and you can just press manage, but if it doesn't, you can scan for the game at the bottom right. You can add a pathway to find the exact location of the launcher, which can be found in Steam, Properties, Local Files, Browse, and there is your Fallout 4 launcher. Then you can scan for the game and as you can see, it's found two games and now you can manage Fallout 4. Once you press the manage button and it's loaded up, you can then go over to the mod section to the left. And this allows you to install any mod, but I'll show you how to do that in another video. Uh, we need to go to the Fallout 4 directory and we need to also download WinRAR and 7-Zip. The link to these will be in the description. And then download Skyrim Script Extender. Once you downloaded the Skyrim Script Extender, you can open it. And this will autom automatically open in WinRAR. And then you drag all these files within the Skyrim script extender. And then you put them in the Fallout 4 directory. You will then need to create a shortcut by right clicking the Fallout 4 SE loader. And then dragging that to desktop, rename it to Fallout 4. And then you have to launch the game through this launcher every time you want to play Fallout 4. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one.